Vision is such an essential part of our lives. So much of what we do and enjoy depends upon the ability to see clearly. So if your vision begins to fail, it can cause great anxiety. But if you understand what is happening with your vision, you gain a sense of control over the situation, providing some peace of mind. One of the leading causes of vision loss in people over 65 is a condition called age-related macular degeneration, also known as AMD. To understand how AMD affects your vision, it's important to understand how the eye works. Light rays enter the eye through the cornea, pupil, and lens. These light rays are focused on the retina, a light sensitive tissue lining the back of the eye. The retina has two areas, the peripheral retina and the macula. The macula is a small area at the center of the retina. The peripheral retina is the large area surrounding the macula. It is the peripheral retina that gives us our side or wide angle vision. It is the macula that gives us our pinpoint vision and allows us to see details clearly, helping us to do things like drive, read, or recognize a face. Age-related macular degeneration, or AMD, is a breakdown of the macula. When the macula doesn't work properly, your central vision can be affected by blurriness, dark areas, or distortion. This condition affects many people as they get older. There are two forms of AMD. One is called atrophic, or dry form. The other is called exudative, or wet form. About 90% of patients who get AMD have the dry form. The retina is made up of many layers that are sandwiched together into a smooth surface. These layers work together, allowing us to see clearly. In people with dry AMD, the layer under the retina, known as the retinal pigment epithelium, or RPE, is affected by deposits, called drusen, as well as other age-related changes. These changes may cause vision to deteriorate. A basic yet important tool for monitoring your vision is called an Amsler grid. You can use it at home to detect changes in your central or macular field of vision. You simply sit in a well-lit area and hold the grid away from you at a comfortable position. If you wear glasses, you should keep them on. Cover one eye and look directly at the point in the center of the grid, but observe the pattern of vertical and horizontal lines in your peripheral vision. Then do the same with the other eye. Typically, a visual abnormality due to AMD would cause some of the straight lines to appear wavy or blurry, or areas to appear dark or even blank. If you notice any new changes in the grid, you should contact your ophthalmologist immediately. If a person with dry AMD notices changes when they use the Amsler grid, this can be a sign that wet AMD is developing. With wet AMD, abnormal blood vessels begin to grow under the retinal layers behind the macula. These blood vessels leak fluid, or bleed, which further blurs or distorts central vision. About 10% of people with macular degeneration have the wet form. If your ophthalmologist suspects macular degeneration, diagnostic techniques such as fluorescein angiography and optical coherence tomography, or OCT, are used to help identify what's going on with the macula. Macular degeneration is a very common vision problem. While we do not know how to prevent or cure this condition, we are learning more about it. Researchers are continually evaluating new forms of medical, surgical, and laser treatments. With early detection, we can often help slow down visual loss and preserve sight. And with our newer treatments, in certain cases, vision can even improve. If you have AMD, understanding your condition and being vigilant about monitoring your vision can help you successfully maintain your quality of life.